convergence between um, the online and the offline is a, is a really interesting um, new development. Primarily because so many people are, um, they're, they're using companion screens. You know, whether it's a mobile phone or a laptop or a desktop or even an iPad or another type of tablet, they're engaging with television content in a way that tends to be either distracted, sort of half looking at it or, you know, half focusing on something else, or engaged in a different way by actually, you know, following Twitter streams or um, getting involved and invested in the direction of the, of the storylines, if it's a drama. But I think primarily the, the key part of this is the evolution of the audience member and his or her belief in their role in the participation of, of television content. No longer are they necessarily happy to simply consume in a very linear way where somebody else is curating the, the direction or, or um, how it is that the, that the content is, is, is going forward, how, how the content is laid out for consumption, they actually now want to engage, they want to participate, they want to be involved in the, the storyline, the, the news item, they want to feel that they're actually participating and, and taking part in this. Web developers, content, interac interactive content developers and television producers, linear storytelling producers can actually work together and create something that's completely new, completely different. Um, there's a couple of really good examples. Uh, one of them is Lost. The, Lost, the, the ABC television series Lost was fantastic, it was very clever in how it tried to keep audiences engaged and also give them that deeper experience that they're demanding. Um, along with the, the linear television offering, you know, the one in the US was on ABC, in the UK was on, I believe it was Channel 4, I can't remember. Um, along with that very linear story that was produced by J.J. Abrams and the other writers, there was also a, a, a parallel storyline, story arc that went on around that, but online. And the lost experience was, um, it, it falls into a, a, an interactive offering that's called the alternative reality gaming environment. They literally created a completely different storyline that used the same characters within the universe and extended that in a really interesting way that challenge the audience members to engage more deeply in the storyline that was happening on screen, whether it was because it forced them to watch the ads in between each of the episodes on, on the television by dropping in clues or dropping in hints about what was happening in the online version, or by asking the audience members to look at um, print advertising 